Heavenly Father, I want to take this time to pray for the fathers today, the T.I. fathers. And to all the T.I.'s fathers out there, I say Happy Father's Day to you. It's coming up tomorrow. And I want to pray blessings over all T.I. fathers that are being targeted in any type of slavery program, especially in the covert gain stocking program and any other program, slavery program. But specifically, I want to pray for the T.I. fathers that's being targeted and persecuted in the covert gain stocking program. And I want to say happy Father's Day to you guys out there. And some of you, a lot of you, or many of you are in the T.I. community, but the fathers out there are going through a lot. And some of you are not able to see your children. Your children have been stolen from you from Satan through the evil agents. So uh, I'm going to pray for you guys out there in the TI community, all the fathers out there. Some wonderful blessings of protection from my Heavenly Father and blessings from my Heavenly Father. Heavenly Father, I lift up all TI fathers out there. Fathers that are being targeted and persecuted in the covert gain stocking program and other slavery programs all over the world, all over America and Canada. In Jesus Christ's name. Heavenly Father, I lift these wonderful souls that you have created, these fathers that you have created, because they are very important to you, Father God. They are the bedrock of society, Father God, and they're a very important, significant part of society, the fathers, Father God, that you have ordained to be head of the children and the wives, Father God, and to be leaders and to have a very significant role and play in the lives of their children heavenly father so father god you have ordained the fathers and assigned the fathers to have that important significance in their children's lives and to be able to impart to them wisdom and and knowledge and understanding and how to bring the identity of what their children are father god to show their children the identity that only fathers can do, Father God. Only fathers can do that for their children. So, Father God, because you have designed it that way for the fathers. So, Father God, I just thank you and I praise you, Father God, for the fathers that you have created, Father God, on this earth. Father God, and I pray, Heavenly Father, for the fathers of the children. Father God, especially the fathers that are being persecuted in the covert gain stocking program that are being targeted and harassed and abused and disfranchised and mistreated and ill-treated and disrespected, Father God, and stolen from and robbed and being treated very cruelly and having all types of unfair and unjust things happening to them, Father God. I lift these fathers up to you today in the TI community, Father God. I lift them up to you and I ask that you will cover these fathers, Father God, all over the world, all over America and Canada and the TI community with the blood of Jesus Christ, Father God. From the crown of their heads to the soles of their feet, that you will cover their spirit, souls, and their bodies and their lives with the blood of Jesus Christ. The calling and destinies that you have for them, their health and their lives, and their testosterone and their sexuality with the blood of Jesus Christ in Jesus Christ's name. I ask, Heavenly Father, that you will cover their souls, the souls of these fathers, their minds, their emotions, their wills, their intellects, their personalities, their moods and temperaments with the the blood of Jesus Christ in Jesus Christ's name. I ask, Father, that you will cover their lifespan and, and their health with the blood of Jesus Christ in Jesus Christ's name. And I ask that you will also preserve these lives of these fathers in the TI community with the blood of Jesus Christ and preserve their health with the blood of Jesus Christ of these fathers in the TI community in Jesus Christ's name, Father God. And the T.I. Truther community, Father God, the fathers that speak the truth and the fathers that are whistleblowers, Father God, 
in the TI community, Father God, that expose evil, that speak the truth, and that expose unrighteousness, and that fend for the ones that can't fend for themselves, and that speak up for the ones that can't speak up for themselves. That you will protect these fathers, Father God with the blood of Jesus Christ and that you will send your angels to guard and protect these fathers in the TI community, Father God, from all evil, harm and danger and from witchcraft attacks, from evil spirited people, from predators, Father God, from violence and terrorism, from premature death, Father God, from robbery and theft, Father God, that you'll protect their homes and their cars, Father God, and their employment and their jobs and their businesses and their merchandise in their businesses and that you'll protect their finances father god and financial assets with the blood of jesus christ and that you will protect their children all the ti fathers out there their children father god whether their children are with them or not father god that you will protect their children father god with the blood of jesus christ and cover their children with the blood of jesus christ in jesus christ's name and that you will send your Guardian angels to protect their children, Father God, of all the TIs, fathers in the TI community. In Jesus Christ's name, everywhere they go, that you will protect their children, Father God, from all evil, danger, and harm, and damage, and and debt, and harassment, and abuse, in Jesus Christ's name, and witchcraft, and all types of evil, in Jesus Christ's name, and from evil spirit to people, in Jesus Christ's name, Father God. I ask, Father God, that you will comfort the fathers, the T.I.'s fathers out there in the T.I. community with the blood of Jesus Christ, that you will comfort them with your comforting hand, Father God, with the comfort of the Holy Spirit, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name, that you will soothe and heal these fathers that's been wounded, Father God, and abused and disrespected and and lied upon and lied to and slandered and gossiped upon, Father God, that has been stolen from, Father God, that has been just treated very ill, Father God, and so many unjust things and unfair things happening to these T.I. fathers out there in the T.I. community, Father God. And that you will heal the fathers that are not able to see their children, Father God, because their children have been stolen from them or their children, they have been deprived of being able to visit their children or be with their children or have their children around. That you will heal those fathers out there like Rigo, Father God, and like Michael uh, Barden, Father God. In Jesus Christ's name and so many T.I. fathers out there in the T.I. community all over the world, all over America and Canada, Father God, that are not able to see their children or their children being turned against them, Father God, behind the lies of the enemy, behind the lies of the enemy operating through the perpetrators and the evil agents, Father God, that speak lies about them to their children about them in Jesus Christ's name and that has caused division and separation between them and their children by the God behind these lies of the enemy about them in Jesus Christ's name and I ask that you release the blood of Jesus Christ to counsel out and destroy every lie that's been spread about T.I. fathers about the fathers in the T.I. community by the God that's been spread to their children been said to their children about them Father God, from evil agents, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name, that you would destroy those lies off of the T.I. fathers with the blood of Jesus Christ, that you will break those evil satanic records of the enemy off of the T.I. fathers, Father God, in the T.I. community with the blood of Jesus Christ and with your anointing and your power and your might, Father, in Jesus Christ's name. I ask, Heavenly Father, that you will supernaturally intervene and heal the breaches between uh, the T.I. fathers and their children, Father God, any gap and separation and isms and schisms and division and discord, Father, and strife between the T.I. fathers and their children, Father God, with the blood of Jesus Christ and the healing sob of the Holy Spirit and the power of the Holy Spirit in Jesus Christ's name, Father God. I pray, Father God, that you will supernaturally intervene and release your cameo angels, Father God, of reconciliation to reconcile things between the fathers, the T.I. fathers that have lost their children and been separated from their children for different reasons, Father God, behind division as well and separation of the enemy, separating them 
of other means, Father God, and evil tactics from evil agents through a evil agents, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name. I pray, Father God, for total restoration for these fathers and healing of these relationships between them and their children, Father God. And total unity back, Father, that you will restore these children back to the T.I. fathers that have lost their children and lost relationships and have lost respect from their children behind the lies of the enemy. Father God, in Jesus Christ's name, that you will turn the hearts of these children back to these T.I. fathers and the T.I. fathers to their children, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name, and that you will break and destroy any breach and any gap between the T.I. fathers and their children with the blood of Jesus Christ and your anointing, Father, in Jesus Christ's name. I ask, Heavenly Father, that you will also heal the broken hearts of the T.I. fathers that has been very abused in relationships and marriages, failed marriage relationships, or significant relationships like intimate relationships with girlfriends and stuff or friendships father god or roommates or any type of relationships in their families father god that you will heal them from all types of re uh fail relationships even boss relationships and supervisor relationships and employment relationships with co-workers or whatever father god i pray our close friendships in Jesus Christ's name that you will heal these T.I. fathers from those relationships father that has went sour and wrong behind evil behind witchcraft behind sorcery behind someone behind split ups and division and discord behind slander and gossip and lies of the enemy that you will heal the hearts of these fathers in the TI community that have lost relationships through division and that also have lost relationships behind death of loved ones, death of spouses, death of girlfriends, death of children, death of uh, family members, significant others, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name as well. I pray that you will heal the hearts of these T.I. fathers in the T.I. community, Father God, from the loss and abandonment and betrayal and the slander and the gossip and the mistreatment and the ill treatment and usury and abuse, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name, from evil relationships, failed relationships that they have went through and are going through right now in Jesus Christ's name. With the healing salve of the Holy Spirit and your healing power, Father, and your anointing. And with the blood of Jesus Christ in Jesus Christ's name. I pray that you release your angels upon these fathers, Father God. Your comforting angels to comfort. To visit these fathers today and comfort them on every side, Father God. From any wounds that they're suffering and hurting and in, in deep part of their hearts, Father. In the deepest part of their soul, Father God. Where they're being wounded because of disappointment and betrayal and abandonment, Father God. And death and separation and ill treatment and unfair treatment, Father God, and abuse and usury from failed relationships and abusive relationships, Father God, perp relationships, Father God, controller and handler relationships, witchcraft relationships, if any T.I. Father had had any relationships or uh, being married to a witch or something, Father God, or have a girlfriend that's a witch or whatever that was a witch and that has just screwed over their lives and voodooed them over witchcraft, Father God. They've been voodooed by their ex-wives that were witches or family members that were witches that cast spells on them and cursed their lives, Father God, that you will heal them from those wounds of witchcraft attacks and defeat and failure and frustration and sorcery, Father God, and that you will heal them from the wounds of having relationships with women that are witches, Father God, whether they've been their spouse or their girlfriend or significant other roommate or whatever. In Jesus Christ's name, Father God, and even family members that have prayed against them from witchcraft, sorcery, divination, voodoo, hoodoo, Satanism, or uh, black magic or whatever in Jesus Christ's name Father God I pray that you will heal these T.I. fathers in the T.I. community from the wounds of witchcraft from the wounds of sorcery and divination from the wounds of failure and defeat because of witchcraft 
the wounds of Satanism, Father God, and satanic ritual abuse from any T.I. Father.